In this video, I will be talking about translation in business and in department. Okay. So we know that translation is basically translating from our language, let's say Arabic to another language. Okay. So if you know that this is the T letter in English, in Arabic, and this is the T letter in English. In English they call it T, in Arabic they call it T. Okay, it's the same sound. So, this translation is only about uh, changing or translating the letters or the words at that level. So, if we have, let's say, Google translation, and we bring a book and the tax in business as well. So this book is written in uh, let's say French. So we just translate it there and then take the book and that's it. Is it okay that uh, someone senior in literature and he knows and understand the let's say Chinese language? Is it is it possible for him to explain to us a book that talks about physics or talks about technology? Of course, he knows the literature and he knows all the words. But can he explain or can he be part of a team to translate an English book to Chinese? So, for example, if we have a book that speaks about uh, medicine and we bring the book is in English so we bring an English guy from literature and we bring a Chinese guy from literature and we, we sit them both to produce a Chinese version of that book is that logically possible? yes okay. literally yes but in the common sense, it's not possible. The possibility of translation is not only translating the text. Okay, it is. It will require not only a guy, I suppose, who is want to translate this book to to French. It means the guy he has to be a doctor that can read and write French and has the ability to write. Because even writing, not everybody who writes a read can produce a book. So these are two skills. The skills of literature and the skill of the same field. He has to come from the same field. That way he can translate this book. Of course, it is easier to translate a book from one language to another language rather than teaching everybody how to speak Chinese or how to speak English or how to speak Arabic okay it's easier to translate so translated the translation is always the best approach to deliver knowledge from community to another and translation is not only literature based we can translate products, we can translate services, we can translate apps, businesses, all this can be translated. But for a guy to be able to reach to the point of translation, it's not only that he can learn, he has to learn. No, he has to also understand the ins and outs and understand both communities in both business ends so that he can transform this product from that community to that community. It is a hard job but it is there and it is the opportunity for everyone who is in the middle of two communities or two business uh, business communities or business uh, areas to participate from translation. 